you'll notice from the inside of the HP silencer that it has the obsolete fiberglass dampening material. This is to be removed and not used again. The new silencing material is made of stainless steel and should be used if you need to keep the sound of the compressor within the original limits. If however noise is not a problem you can remove the internal silencing material and don't have to replace it but that is entirely your choice. The valve and spring should have free movement as shown. So you got jacking points. Use the two bolts as shown to push off the plate and remove it from the housing. You would normally exchange the spring if it's worn. Also, check that the bush inside the NRV is not too badly worn. If it is, you need to push it out and replace it with a new bush. Visually check the non-return valve seat and the non-return valve itself for excessive wear. If it's badly worn, replace it. The reassembly of the valve is quite straightforward, it's just a reverse of the dismantling procedure. Bolt up the housing as shown to complete the procedure, you're now ready to put it back onto the compressor. Thank you for watching.